why am I making these videos? What am I trying to say? What do I think it's going to do for the freestyle music genre? Well, in this video, I'm going to try to do just that. Answer the question, why? So let's go. Hey, what's up, freestylers? Latif here, exploring with you the voice, sound, and culture of freestyle music. And every week on this channel, we discuss ways that we, as a freestyle music community, can recognize, define, and nurture the culture that we know lies within the genre. We'll also be talking with not only different artists and other freestyle personnel, but also some amazing fans in search of ideas that can help us resurrect the genre back to the way we remember it. If you're new to this channel and feel like this is something that you can get down with, do me a favor and smash that like button. And if you click subscribe and the little bell beside it, every time I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know. Someone messaged me the other day and asked a question. Now, I usually like them to ask questions in the comments so that way other people who might have the same question can also see it. He said the reason he messaged it to me was because he didn't want to offend me. Well, the question was straight to the point. He asked me, Latif, what's the purpose of all these videos? Now, he did give me props and said he enjoyed all my videos. However, he did ask what it was I was trying to say. Now, in the beginning of each of my videos, I do mention that I'm here to help explore the voice, sound, and culture of freestyle music. And in all honesty, I really thought that was the answer. But when I really got down and thought about it, I realized that really wasn't the answer after all. I do tell you what the videos are about and I answer a bunch of little questions. However, I haven't answered the biggest question of them all. Why? Why do I make these videos? You see, he didn't offend me at all. If anything, he helped me. I'm not your typical freestyle fan. In fact, I don't think I would even use the word fan at all. I'm not a fan of the music. I'm not a fan of the artists. I'm not a fan of any of the producers or anyone connected to the genre in any way. The term that comes closer to the way I feel is an affection. But an affection not for anyone or anything in particular, but rather an affection for the system as a whole. In other words, freestyle. What it was, what it stood for, what it is now, what it stands for, and what it will eventually become and stand for then. Many people can listen to a song, watch a video, attend a performance, and then go about their lives. But for me, as well as others, I'm sure, whether they want to admit it or not, this is our life. My closest friends I met through this genre, my wife, this is me all day long. From the shows that I book to the artists that I manage, these videos that I create and the books that I write, this is me all day long. My entire being is invested in this genre. I go to bed at night thinking, what can I do to help step it up? I have such high hopes for the genre, even more so than I did back in the days. And I'm constantly trying to figure out how I can help create more opportunities for more people using freestyle. I'm trying to convince people that there are a ton of opportunities in freestyle and that it can benefit them the same way that it's benefited me for so many years. There's going to be people who don't want you to be involved because in their mind they think that there's, there's not enough room. And on the contrary, I think that by getting more people involved in the genre it will actually open up bigger doors and more opportunities. It's like a tree. Right now, it's a small tree with just a few branches, but each branch represents an opportunity. But if we get more people to come in from the outside, what they're gonna do is they're gonna create another branch. And next thing you know, we're gonna have this huge tree. This is how I see it. A lot of people don't see it this way. And a lot of people think I'm fucking crazy. I'm inviting people to come on board and talk to me. I'm not asking for anything no strings attached. I love this genre and I don't want to see it go anywhere. And I know with me and with the people who are involved, currently involved, that's not enough to keep it, to sustain it. That's going to be done by introducing it to other people. My wife brought something to my attention the other day that I found pretty interesting. She said, you realize that when the genre was at its peak, that it was the first time in music history that young 
American Latinos practically took over the industry. We were putting out mainstream hits, selling out club and concert events everywhere, and radio kept us on heavy rotation. We were stars, all of us. So here's a question for you. If you had a chance to come up with an idea for one of my videos, what topic would it cover and what would be the title? Your answer to this question will become the springboard to many discussions about this topic and eventually, and only with your help, will we finally discover the voice, sound, and culture of freestyle music. Hey, I really appreciate you watching this video and if it made any kind of sense to you, that thumbs up will let me know. And if you click subscribe and the little bell beside it, every time I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know. My name is Latif Mercado, and until next time, keep it real, keep it peace, and remember, freestyle for life.